Yo, what is up, guys? Chavez Gaming is here today, and I'm bringing you guys a brand new video. Uh, this is my first commentary, or just a non-live commentary I've done on this channel. So, uh, sorry if you just heard that. It was uh, my phone. But, uh, anyways, uh, let me talk about some new Call of Duty Ghost uh, updates. Um, so, well, I guess it's not really an update. It's more of a leak because it is a leak. But uh, Call of Duty Ghost, the first retail game, uh, got leaked on the internet. All links in the descriptions below for the articles and everything. You can read up on your own. I'm just going to you know, briefly summarize it all together, but in a shorter version of all three articles. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, first of all, you'll see pictures on the screen throughout the commentary as well. Um, so, you should see a picture of Call of Duty Ghost right now. Um, the, the game has two discs, and this is brand new. Like, uh, Call of Duty has never had two discs before, so that means this game is like going to have so much stuff on it. It has to have, you know, contain two discs. So, that's pretty cool. So, I guess they added more stuff than they usually do to other, you know, uh, Call of Duties and stuff like that. Um, sorry if you just said that. I clapped my hands. But, um, also, we have 14... Multiplayer maps, okay, they're all new. So the first one is Prison Break, Octane, Fright, White Out, Stormfront, Siege, Warhawk, Sovereign, I don't know if I pronounced that right, sorry if I don't, Stonehaven, Overload, Chasm, don't know if I pronounced that right either, so sorry. But uh, Flooded, Strike Zone, and then lastly, if you pre-order the game, which I did, uh, it's a free fall bonus map. So, pre so basically, that's uh, four all 14 of them. Okay, but just in case you you know, you know if you it'd be 13 if you didn't pre-order and shit like that. So um, yeah, it's pretty cool. And we got some new game modes and old game modes stuff like that. So the old ones that are returning from previous Call of Duties are Team Deathmatch, Free for All, Search and Destroy, Domination, and Kill Confirmed. You know, everybody knows what those are. You know, from MW3 and Black Ops, Black Ops 2, etc. So, yeah, um, we got some new game modes though. Some pretty cool ones actually. So, um, the first game mode I'll be talking about is uh, Search and Rescue. Oh, by the way, this commentary is going to be a little short since it's not a whole bunch because I'm just summarizing everything. But, uh, yeah, anyway, so first one Search and Rescue. There's videos on YouTube over it. Go look them up. Uh, it's a mix of Search and Destroy and Kill Confirmed. And it's basically whenever you drop the, uh, whenever you die, you drop dog, ta dog tags and then you respawn. But if an enemy picks them up be before you respawn, like they pick up your, they kill you, pick up your dog tags then um and you don't respond in that time before they pick up your dog tags uh you won't come back to the next round and then you also uh defuse and plant bombs and things like that so that's pretty cool it seems like real competitive and intense and all that that type of game mode so should be fun uh next is grind there's videos on that on youtube as well uh basically <clears throat> excuse me you recover dog tags and take them to the objective marker and then whenever you make you get the objective marker, you'll uh, score for your team. So it's basically like capture the flag, so but with dog tags. It's pretty cool. So it's like the new revamped version, like 2.0, capture the flag in a way. Except capture the dog tags, you know what I'm saying? So that's pretty cool. Uh, next we have Blitz. And Blitz is basically uh, <clears throat> capture the flag as well. But you just have to touch the flag. You don't have to bring it back to your spawn because it teleports you back there to your spawn. So, like, let's say I'm running at the flag or whatever. You know, I, I touch it and then it teleports you back. Oh, sorry, I just hit my mic. It, uh, you go to the flag, right? It, you touch it or whatever, get on, get on it, and then it teleports you back to your spawn. And then you get a point. So you just don't camp there and, like, you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, get it and get the flag at each time. You know, it'd be kind of cheap. You know what I'm saying? Next we have Cranked, which a lot of people saw this, uh, you know, just go look that up as well. It's a really intense game mode as well. So, uh, it's where, it's a new TDM variant, which is Team Deathmatch, in case you don't know what TDM means. And it's where, once you get a kill, you, uh, have 30 second, you have a 30 second count. So, uh, countdown timer. And then if you, in those 30 seconds, if you do not get another kill in that time limit, you explode, basically. So uh, that that would be pretty intense and fun and all that. Fun with your friends and stuff. So, uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, next, we have Infected, which is really not new. But for thi this time, you actually earn, like, XP and stuff, like, nor like more XP, uh, like, normal game modes and stuff. So you can rank up, and it'll be just real fun for your friends and all that. And then this next one is real new. Like, we've, you know, 
Uh, we don't even have any videos on it. Uh, at least I'm not sure of we do. But it's um, hunted, and it's basically normal you, and free for all versions. So normal meaning like team deathmatch, I, I guess, and you know, just regular team versus team, and then uh, free for all. Okay, everybody knows what that is. And it's where uh, resources are limited, and you have to fight for control of weapon drops to gain superior superiority. And it sounds like something we've never seen before. You know, I've never seen this in a game or nothing like that. So it sounds pretty fun. It sounds like it'd be like fun with your friends and stuff just to mess around. Probably be a lot of videos of like trolls on that or something in the future when this game comes out. The game's really close to coming out. We got about two weeks left. So uh, that's in the this video. So thank you guys for watching. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. So uh, peace.